Hi, I'm G. And I'm Michelle. And we are the, the Bin Pickers. Pickers. How are you guys doing today? Good, good. Oh, good, good, good. Sold Sunday. Yes, it is. And yes. we sold a ton of stuff. We, we did. had a really good weekend for sales. And there's really several reasons that we did. Like, we got really good stuff when we went to the bin on our on my birthday. Yeah, we did. We got some great stuff. We sold a whole ton of that stuff. That's one reason. Mm -hmm. Also, this week, we worked really hard this week. Um, so that obviously helps. <laughs> and then um, some people that watch us bought some stuff i know right that, that also helps and our son's program that he made and michelle uses to list everything so then she lists it on all three so everything that we've been listed she lists on all three so all the poshmark macari sales we wouldn't have it without that right so that's a big part of our great sales i, I think Definitely. Don't you? I mean, yeah, and we actually had some auctions ending on the men's and women's. Right. Auction is we sent it out on eBay out to auction. We started at a price five ninety nine, six ninety nine, like that. Yeah, I know because a lot of people, people can ask, bid it up to whatever, or it sells for what you put it on. Right. So That's a lot of people ask, like, well, do we start our auctions at ninety nine cents? We do not. Um, we don't do that. We used to do that a long time ago when stuff would actually, you know, it would get more bids, um, but. Now, you kind of want to put it on for like, okay, if you sell it for six bucks, you're fine with that, or five dollars, it's fine. You know what I mean? Right. Um, so, that's what we usually do when we sell it to auction. Now, most of this stuff is buy it now, right? Right. So, yeah, and there's a ton of it. but And Isaac's program that he did for me, it's only for buy it now. Like, it's not auction. Like, the right. stuff I sent out to auction, I don't put out on Macari or Poshmark. Right. Right. So. I also got those men's underwear, which you'll see in here. And they actually sold pretty good. We got some curtains that we sold really good. Yeah. So, okay, well, yeah. let's get into so it So I think Isaac is going to let a few people try his program to see if they like it as much as you and do. And maybe so, give me some, give us some feedback on what So I think. think he's going to... Maybe this week. Do that. Hopefully. Keep yeah. you posted. I know. I was excited because it's like, it's basically, you know, I list it. It's almost like listing on Poshmark, his little program. Right. Um, it's almost like listing on Poshmark, like the stuff you pick. Right. And then you click Poshmark, it goes. You click Macari, and then it goes. There's still a few things you have to pick. Right. The pictures automatically go over. The yeah. title goes over. All Makes that stuff. It so much so, easier. But it's not like, a, oh, here, I'm going to take my listings from eBay and then send them to Poshmark. Because I know some no. of these other programs, that's what they do. That's His is more like when I'm listing it, it goes to all three. So right. maybe... Yeah, he wants to like get it out there so other people can use it too. So he's been working on that. He, <laughs> I know, I know he's working on on some other things as well. He wants to have a page where you can list your stuff on, right? Eventually, he wants to have his own page where you list something and it automatically goes to the other ones right on his page but i think he's making us a page where we can do it. so he's working on some other stuff too i don't get it he's like has all his code open and i'm like he, no idea anyway let's get into sold sunday but that's not what he ultimately wants to do no he's just doing this i think and he wants to make a little money so that he can use that to make what he wants to make which really isn't this he he really did this for you right i know isn't so, that sweet <laughs> yeah and he's 15. i know okay okay sorry we'll get Got into soul sunday because we have so much stuff a lot of stuff i like so thankful and like i feel like totally blessed that we got to we sold this much stuff we did put a lot of work in this week. all week was and it was just hard. like it was you know you obviously put in and then you get what you put in does that make sense? you get what you put in people get what they deserve no just kidding we're not gonna sing kid rock songs oh no <laughs> okay lululemon bra you just got this 35 dollars on macari what you are gonna but, sing kid rock songs <laughs> well not right now but we got really good stuff at the bin helped a lot as well it really i mean makes a big difference we obviously. did really good when we went to the bin God provides. 
He provided for you on your birthday. He did? Yes. Well, I want to pretend it's my birthday again and go back. <laughs> okay, we got this Lucky Bag, um, Stash Bag, I think is what it's called. $34 yeah. on Macari. You can stash. Stash. I think bag. that's the style of what it is. So, yeah, $34 on Macari. So, okay. those two Macari. I have a couple more Macari somewhere. Okay. And it's then kind of all, nothing's really We sold this here. made well. Okay, so most of the stuff we sold Friday afternoon to Sunday around noon. Plus shipping. Plus shipping. But there is a few things. Like this we sold on Friday, I think, morning. I had I I had gone to the post office. Right. But I had asked her, I'm like, hey, can I put it in sold Sunday? <laughs> this was Rachel over on Poshmark. So, right. Rachel, thank you so much. So, almost all of it. Friday afternoon to Sunday around noon. Right. Plus shipping. Right. But I want to say thank you to sold. Rachel. She got this Madewell jacket. She said she saw it in the video, and then she went to Poshmark and um, made me an offer for $40. Right, and I thank thought that was really you. nice. So, Rachel, thank you so much. It is a cute jacket. I hope she loves it. But she said it's so hot there anyway. She doesn't need a jacket. So, <laughs> I get it. This is a Talbots. We just got this as a plus-size 2X linen tunic, $19. And that was also a Poshmark. A whole ton of this stuff is stuff we just, just got at the bin. I know. Spanx bra... This was also you just got. I got this with, with that Lululemon. Lululemon at the same and time. And this, yeah. like the tag, the, not the tag, but like the lettering where the size was wore off. So I looked at this size. I mean, this logo still looks really good. This yeah. tag looks good. It was just the printing right back here. Yeah, you can't read it. Um, so I looked at the UK size on other people, that same bra. And then, so evidently it was extra large. Anyway, sold that for 20 bucks on Poshmark. This cute Kate Spade. Sarah got this. Thank you, Sarah. I wonder if she saw it in the video. Super cute. It's like perfect fall bag. It's yeah. like a suede and then it has like croco embossed leather. So Sarah, thank you so much. Thank and you. that was $41. $41. I know, right? That was awesome because we just got that too. These are cool pants. Um, the slacker pants. They have some little slits in them and I mentioned that. Yeah, they're, they're worn. They're worn, but still tons of wear left in them. $25 on Poshmark. Poshmark, huh? And these, Doc Martens, we got these like about two weeks ago, I think. It really helps to have them listed on all three. I mean, because you never did that. Never did you do that before his program. No, I did it before his program, but I had to have them all open, and then it was like, took forever, and I could But you only didn't list, so list everything. Not like, every single thing. We would pick some, most of the stuff and be like, okay, we're going to put this on Macari, this on Poshmark. Right. You would list some stuff, but not all of them. Right, on the so and, it does help, definitely. These are Doc Martens. Somebody came in and bought them. They didn't even offer $35 on Poshmark. You so. sold those on Poshmark? Yep. And they were the Alfie style. So they're like a canvas. They weren't like the leather kind. These we picked up from Van. He sent them to us. I know. Way. He did send them to us in a, one of the boxes, and he's sending us some more boxes this week. So that's exciting. I couldn't imagine wearing those with a heel so, like that. Yeah, they were from Van. These sold for $14 on Poshmark. Their mm -hmm. Shoe Dazzle, I think is what the brand was. Thank you, Van. I know. Thanks, Van. And thank you to the person that bought them. Now where are you going? <sighs> Someone, this was... This I, have, was I have three pages of stuff, so i got to figure out where I wrote it all. This was exercise that we sent out to auction. auction. And we started at $5.99. I know. I'm going to say $6 because it's easier to add up $6 and $5.99. So... This moving comfort bra, six bucks. This Lululemon jacket, this was actually, well, we got it at the bin in California. And then Rose wore it for a while, and then she was like, nah, she didn't want it anymore. It has like pilling on the fabric. Yeah. And I mentioned that in the listing. I wasn't it's sure what style warm. it was. It sold out to auction for $13.50. Okay. This cute Fabletics top. This wasn't extra large, and I think that's why. But it still is. No, I know, but I think that's why it sold, like, right? It was extra large. It sold for eighteen fifty, which is, I think, pretty high, I'm, you know, for a tank top. But I think because it was an extra large, yeah. and it's really cute. Oh, it and cute. it's not, like, tight, you know what I mean? It, it would have, like, strappy. So, yeah, eighteen fifty out to auction. Okay. Pearl Izumi, um, just, like, a cycling tank top, 8 bucks. Jennifer got this Athleta top. It's super cute. It's, like, crunch punch or... Crunch I don't remember what, exactly what it was called. Crunch. And she got that for $6. Thank you, Jennifer. Thank you. This Athleta skirt. See, look at this Athleta we're selling. <laughs> this, for not much, though. I well, mean, I mean, you it, know, it, it all sell. adds up. 
Doesn't this sold, sell. this little skirt sold for nine bucks out nine to bucks. auction. Cute. This Lucy skirt. This feels like that Lou. I know it's like the Lucy tech or whatever, but it feels like Lululemon. Yeah. You know what I mean? You would think it'd be Lululemon. Um, and that sold for ten fifty out to auction. I knew as soon as I seen this orange thingy there what it was. Yeah. These were also something Rose had in her closet. We got at the bin in California. And they were ripped. And she She sewed them, them right? They were ripped when we got them, but then she wore them. I think she maybe wore them once or twice. They had a rip in the crotch. They're kind of faded, but they're yeah. really cool. And I don't know what style they were. Could've so I just uh, put them as joggers. They still had the rip tag, which I was yeah. kind of surprised. They sold out to auction for eleven fifty. Yeah. But they were ripped right here. She sewed it up. And I took a picture of that. And that's why they sold. Well, I took a picture of that. Oh, did I say she took? Oh, you said you did. Or I said that. I take that the pictures. The, <laughs> said that you in the list. You list the stuff. I just Yeah, take he the takes picture. all the pictures. So if there's anything wrong with the pictures, it's all on him. That's all my fault. <laughs> Sometimes we just And if go, there's whatever. anything wrong with the listing, and there was one in here, I know for sure, that wasn't it's listed my fault. properly. That's, that's Okay, I mess up. Everybody messes up. Okay. You know, what can you do? Vintage, spandex, shiny, leggings, eight bucks. We used to do a lot better with those, um, but still eight bucks. They don't weigh much. These are cute Athleta Velocity pants or something. They feel like super nice. They, they, they are. And they have this like flat edge hem. Um, they sold for nine bucks. It just doesn't sell very good. I think that it's more of like a buy it now Poshmark thing. I think. I don't know. Marmot base layer pants, eight bucks. Out to auction. And then Annie got these cute champions. She said if the Ravens get to play, she'll be all set this year. Um, these are super cute. What did they, they say? They said feel so, these. I mean, these I, feel like... These feel really nice, and the waistband is really cool on yeah. them, so I hope Annie likes them. She actually has a YouTube channel also, Just Call Me Annie. So if you check out her YouTube oh, wait, channel, it's kind of fun. I know. She yeah. comments on all our videos. She's bought, oh, okay. she bought a couple of stuff, things from us. She shares my stuff in my closet. She got those for eight bucks. So Annie, thank you so much. Okay. I think she's going to like them. They they feel really cool. They do feel really cool. And they, they're like brand new. So Lululemon? These are Lululemon Wonder Under something or other. So something out to auction, Lululemon. 16 bucks. And then Marissa got these Nike Pro like little crop capri legging things um so eight bucks on those thank you marissa and that's the way she puts it on legging things i don't remember well you know when you're listing on ebay you thank can't you. put thank you, by the way. i know marissa thank you 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 can't put legging and tights can't put both you can't put both and i so yeah i always and then it's like you can't do this because you're spamming or something like that so spamming you know poshmark's like whatever it's just like the nike cole han you can't put nike and or cole han nike air you have to put nike air all together to list it on ebay but poshmark's like it's yeah. fine poshmark they don't Macari, care it's like if whatever you spam they don't care <laughs> Well, no, I mean, it's actually called, it's actually Colon Nike Air. I don't no, know I why know, I know. eBay doesn't let you do that. This was from Van, I this think. This was another thing from Van. It's a new attack Briggs skirt. Super cute. It actually has, like, pink pinstripes in yeah. it. I think that'd be super cute with, like, a pink little sweater. Yeah, or a gray sweater. No, too much gray. Or Just black, a pink. No, green. pink. Light pink. Sold that for go, 10 bucks. You go with anything. It's true. I listed this, and I sold it, I think, within a half hour of me listing it. Um, Cabby Serenity Tea. Serenity tea? Is what it's called. So I looked up the number, but I sat there for like five minutes when I'm listening. I'm like, is this blue? Is it gray? I can't really tell. It's blue gray. It's blue. Because I looked up their gray one and I'm like, it's just not quite. And then I looked up blue and we sold that for 18 bucks. 18 bucks. But I was like, I was super happy. I Remember I like listed it. I listed one more thing and then I got an offer on that. Yeah. I'm like, except... Okay, so anyway, Nike Pro Girls Hoodie, six bucks, out to auction. This was a buy it now, just listed this. Super cute. Look at these sleeves. We, we never, we never this week got all the plus size listed I did. that we had. We I did, had I, so much stuff He to has a bunch of pictures. I'm still working on them. But you got most of the plus size. Most so of the plus size. There's one more box size. of plus size. So I have that, lots of 4X size stuff on. Yeah. And this, this was. Like, definitely one of the cuter shirts. It was a Catherine's. Um, Gail got this. Thank you, Gail. 
like I listed that and I got an offer oh, pretty Gail quick on that. This, huh? So yeah, fourteen dollars. Right. So you. thank you. Back to auction. Nike Girl Scort, six bucks. There's like no rhyme or reason to how we set this up. Yeah. <laughs> now because we're we're still on auction. <laughs> Yeah, this awesome. Two Nike Tempo girls shorts, Two six girls. bucks. Wow, they only sold for six bucks, huh? Well, they're girls. I know, and it's hard because I should put on like the listing, like these are girls, not women's. Because I was looking at Hot Topic stuff. They list their stuff as girls when it's like, I know it's like a junior women's, but they say it's girls. So I think sometimes when I'm listing stuff, it's like, oh, it's girls. So you, you know what I mean? Like I should say little girls I, I mean i don't know little girls i don't know anyway i'm totally going they don't say stuff. girls and women they just say it's like girls boys or something like that on the hot topic website it says it hmm. it's okay. rose's birthday coming up so i was just looking at there on there because they had clearance i didn't mm -hmm. get anything your birthday's before hers i know and then luke two days apart <laughs> so won't get any work done that week yeah right We'll be here next Sunday on my birthday. Next Sunday to your birthday? Yeah. Yeah. Two girls Nike Tempo running shorts. These are were like littler ones, I think. Uh thirteen sixty three. Little girls. Little girls. I don't know what to put. It gets confusing. This is Nike USA Wrestling, six bucks. Auction. Now I think we're back to buy it now. Yeah, there's probably some more auction somewhere. I was surprised. We actually sold a bunch of stuff. Like people just came in and bought stuff. Like this. Like, they didn't make an offer. They just bought it. 25 but, I bucks. I mean, look how cute that is. It is very cute. It's a circle skirt, but it has, like, Wait, kind of what's a it called? calico-y, prairie kind of look. T tater sacks. No, what's this called? Tater sacks. Oh. That's the brand. Tater sacks? Like, tater. Like, you know. Yeah. Like, you got a tater. A tater. <laughs> tater. And you're going to put it in a sack. Sacks. S-A-X. Like, a gunny sacks. Sacks. That was $25 tater on sacks. that skirt. Got and these two, these new attack mud, they're like Ponty knit. Isn't that what it says? High rise camo. They're camo, and that's why I got them. Yeah, and they're skinny little leggings. Cute, they're extra though. small. Eighteen bucks. So they are awesome. super cute, though. They are. I love this camo stuff. I'm lost. I don't know where we are. Oh no, I hate, I found it. It was on the same page. Okay, so we'll get into the rest of the stuff. So much stuff. Uh, Almost done. So, like, thankful, right? We got to print all this stuff now. I know, right? It's all good. It's been a long time since so we had this much stuff to print. Yeah. This is North Face Gotham Goose Down Jacket, 50 bucks. Gotham? Gotham is the style. Okay. This is a vintage Gotex bikini, 26 bucks. Super high rise. Yeah. And high, high cut. I like those Love vintage Gotex. Okay, here's one set of curtains. Yeah, so we just picked these up on my birthday. They're 100% we linen. They're pottery barn. There's four of them. So, I like just to make sure you look at the tags on the curtains because some curtains are really good. Like yeah. these, I knew they were pottery barn, and I knew they 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 said 100% linen. So I'm like, they have to be decent. We sold these four for 139 dollars. 139 dollars. For those four curtains. I'll take it. I guess so. I mean, I think if you go into a like a thrift store too, you know how they have this stuff hanging? They're really not that expensive usually for curtains. Depends on the thrift store. It does depend. But just, you know, check the tags. I mean, we usually check the tags on any curtains we see. But we get ours at the bin. That's where we shop, the Goodwill outlet. I know. It's by the pound. And we lucked out because definitely just what we somebody had, I mean, those were like brand new and the other ones we sold, they'll be coming up. They were like really nice. They obviously just, you know, redecorating. So they just got rid of it or they only had them for a year or something. I don't know. They were really nice. Who knew men's underwear and curtains were going to get us good sales. Right. Well, Ashley came in and she bought a couple things from, actually she Ashley. bought four things. Okay. She These were this? super cute. These remember? are cute. The, and they're, there's like a vintage, kind they're of a paper vintage. bag waist, vintage and overalls, short all things. Uh -huh. Yeah, I actually got these 20 bucks. 20 she bucks. got the next three things too. Okay. She got this cute jacket. Um, Settle Down is a brand. It's from Windsor Store. It's like a satiny track like jacket. 14 bucks on that. Okay. Thank you, Ashley. She got a Hush Puppies 
You can use it as a sarong. This thing is You can cute. use it as a wrap, um, you know, like a scarfy kind of thing. There's like tons of different uses for that. Oh, hush puppies. Huh? Hush puppies. Seven fifty on that one. And then she also got this one. Lauren, LC by Lauren Conrad, which is a Kohl's. It's oh, like it's a crushed too. velvet, cold shoulder, super soft, perfect color for fall. Mm -hmm. So Ashley got that, and that was $10. She's in Arizona. She said her bins suck there. In Arizona? Yeah. Never been to a bin there. I know, we haven't. I know some people get some good stuff there. I mean, I guess it depends on which one. There's a couple different ones in Arizona, so I'm not sure Is which there? one she's going to. Okay. But... I felt her pain because sometimes it's no good here either. <laughs> yeah, some sometimes it's not. But Ashley, thank you so much for those. And sometimes purchases. it's amazing. Sometimes it is. Okay, we got this fossil bag. Fossil bag recently. It's a coated canvas. Had a few little spots. Put that in the listing. Um, twenty eight bucks. Twenty eight bucks. And he actually, it didn't come with a fob, but you had that fob, and it's not actually the original fob for well, it, but it totally goes. So if I see. A coach, fossil, any decent purse that's destroyed. Yeah. Like, but the like fob, I don't want it. Yeah. But, but this totally looks I, cute. I take these off. Because, I mean, I probably could have sold this for $10, 15 mm, I don't know. Maybe. But yeah. we put it on there. I sold the purse I for $28. I bucks. But I, I take them off and hold them. But and we it sold, went with that purse. I put it on. Yeah. It sold it pretty quick, too. Now we're back to auctions. Women's exercise. Women's exercise. Two Nike Tempo running shorts. Women's. Ten forty nine. Printed. Cute. Super cute. Very cute. Ten forty nine. Ten forty nine. We usually do better with that. That's the thing. Short you send it off to auction. You get what you get, right? But that's also sometimes when we're at the bend. Okay, this is lightweight. We're gonna send this stuff. You know, we usually will send bras, exercise. And that kind of stuff out to auction. That's usually what we pick to send out to auction. Right. As opposed to putting it on. And some right auctions now. sell really good. It makes up for the ones that don't sell great. Right. right. I mean. And plus, it gets you some sales for that. Day. Yeah. Sometimes, if you don't sell at auctions, you might not have any sales hardly. That's true. So. So this Under Armour lot, surprisingly, it sold for twenty six bucks. Twenty six. I think that's awesome. Yeah, it's super cute. It is a cute lot. Yeah. You Black did good and blue there. goes together. Good. And then another Nike lot. I think this has a black top, tank top and then the legacy pants or something like legacy leggings pants. or something. Uh-huh. Super cute. Yeah, those sold for fourteen fifty. Okay. Thank you. I know Lori had bid on those. And, yeah. And then um, somebody came in out with her. So I saw you, Lori. <laughs> okay, this is Barb got this. Uh, oh, new gotcha. Attack Tech Gear bra, eight bucks, sports nice. bra. It's really cute. The inside feels like it's all like bonded on the inside to like bonded. smooth. You know what I mean? Yeah, I hope you like it, Barb. Thank you. Do you see smooth. what I'm saying? Like, see how it would make like smoothing. It's like smoothing right here. Okay. See how this is like bonded, so yeah. there's not like a seam that's gonna be. Like... So you can't see the. No, no, no that's not, not what it is. Has nothing to do with that. Sorry, Barb. <laughs> No, I just thought the way you talk, you make it smooth no. so it doesn't... Smooth, I'm saying like smoothing. You know what I mean? Like it smooths it out instead of... Sure. Um, I got it. He doesn't understand. Okay, halogen cashmere sweater, 12 bucks. Now we're back to buy it now. Oh, because this was a Poshmark. We sold this this morning. This? Yeah. You saw on Poshmark. Katmandu. Yeah. They're like seam sealed, rain pants. They have a little bit of wear on the edge. But they're... Perfect for outdoors. You're going to go hiking. We all have a little wear on the edge. Don't True. We? $17 on those. New Tag Victoria's Secret. 14. Was this on Poshmark or this was no, on eBay? No, this was eBay. 14 bucks. Since I know, too. Global shipping. I got to say, we used to sell tons of stuff through global shipping. Yeah. Not much anymore. It used to be on the weekend, we'd have like, I don't know, five, ten things would be global shipping. Yeah. Not, not so much anymore. eBay has just been really weird. Well, and then I had something went to the Global Shipping Center. It's just sitting there for like seven days now. It's just sitting there. I don't hmm. know what they're doing with it. Okay, so then we got this Torrid dress. Did I say that Victoria's Secret at $14? I'm not sure. I think so. This super, super cute Torrid dress mm -hmm. um, sold for 22 bucks. 22 bucks. And this is back to buy it now. Did I say that? I know, isn't that fun and cute? That is. That's fun. I know. And these are Teva. Yes, they are. Kids. 
I didn't realize they were kids, but then when we did the video, I'm like, I it must be youth because it has a Y. Um, but Y means youth. Usually. Sold them for 16 bucks. 16 bucks. You running out of space? Okay. We can move some stuff here. Well, I'm almost through here. We've had these on for a long time. They're six Victoria's Secret new with tag underwear. Yeah, they're all new. Yeah, they're all brand new with tags. Um, and we sold those for 30 bucks for 30 six bucks. of them. So five And they're super there. light. So yeah. I, I pick up any of these Victoria's Secret ones I see with the tags. No, we, we usually pick up any new underwear we see. For the Because then part. we'll usually make a lot up. Or some of them are yeah. even good And you got 30 bucks for that. It doesn't weigh much. 30 bucks. Love it. Nike shorts. Um, sold these on Macari. 15 bucks. On Macari. Yeah. Awesome. I, I list them for 19. I sold them like an hour on Macari. See, yeah. maybe we should do our exercise stuff singly like that on Macari. Maybe we should. We That's just the got thing. these two. All this exercise stuff was auctioned on eBay, so it never went to Macari or, or Poshmark. Poshmark. So, and we have a bunch of men's stuff going out too. That went out yesterday. That's going to end next week. Yeah, exercise stuff. That's true. These Papi Papio. <laughs> I'm not sure I say it. By Birkenstock it has sure. a little butterfly on it. They're like wedge. Super cute. Lots of interest in these. I had tons of people liking them. I got an offer on Macari this morning for 40 bucks. I was super excited about that. Wait, so, you sold these on Macari too? Yeah, it sold those on Macari, 40 bucks. Uh, we sold a lot of stuff on Poshmark and Macari. I know, we? yeah. We had to move some stuff. We got some Birkenstocks. Men's Birkenstocks. We've never really had Birkenstocks like this. I know, we got those boots, we got these, we got And the we other. Sold, all, sold them. Sold them all. Oh, yeah. yeah, these cool men's Birkenstocks, 50 bucks. 50 bucks. But they're big. They're size like, what size are they? 13, I think. Was it 13? 13. Yeah, which is a pretty big size. So I think that's why somebody just came in and bought them. 50 bucks. I'll take it. This Under Armour hoodie, men's, 24 bucks. Yeah. We just got that too. It's cool. It has like the antlers yeah, on no, it. Yeah, I, no, I, I really like it. It was, but it was a 2X, too big for me. This is also from Vance and these Oh, us. yeah, he did, didn't he? In his mystery boxes that he sends us. We sold a bunch of those other men's shorts that he sent us to. We sold three of them this week for 40 bucks. Yeah. For a lot of three of them. So, yes, very thankful to Van. So, we got these from Van. Yes, they sold for 13 bucks. Thank you, Van. I know. These diesel, just got these. I just got two, and we only sold one of them. Right? Okay, well, I'll take it. 28 bucks for those. 28 bucks. 28 dollars. And then this next thing. But we still have a bunch of good stuff on. We haven't sold yet that we got. And I, this we, we still did. have some stuff we haven't even listed yet. That's true. That's sitting there. Like you got there. those pillows. You sold two of them. We already sent those I out. Know. I did sell two of those pillows for 40 bucks on Macari. Yeah. And I have the other two. So. They had the pink flamingo exciting. on them. I know. Exciting. Okay. It's, it's outside the box stuff. We don't normally get pillows. We well, sold it. I look at that we stuff. We don't get a lot of curtains. But we, we look at them. that stuff. It's just not usually good that good resale value on stuff. Not that there's not nice cur curtains, but a lot of them are from Walmart or whatever. Still nice looking, but not good resale value, really. This was from Thread Up, I believe. Men's. Thread Up Men's box that we got. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, we did good on that box. We sold a ton of the stuff. Yeah, I was surprised. It wasn't, didn't seem like that good a box, but we sold a lot of stuff. This yeah. is really heavy. I wouldn't have never got it at the bin. Yeah, we wouldn't, exactly. But Mark New York leather jacket, 28 bucks. And we paid $4 a piece for those things, yeah. right? Was it $4? Uh, I think it was close to that, yeah. Now I can't remember. Okay, so Ibiza Swim, 9 bucks. Yeah, it was $4 right here. Not the, those we sold for nine dollars. The other thing, thread up boxes was four dollars. Okay. Van got this Nike golf oh, Van pullover this. jacket, eleven bucks. Thank you, Van. He sends us stuff and buys our stuff. I know, huh. isn't he sweet? Well, I think he bought this too. He did. He got this new tag speedo jacket thing. Um, twelve bucks. Is it full zip? It is full zip. Yeah. It's like a soft shell, or it's it, almost it like says, a sweatshirt. Oh, A C S T. Yeah, I don't know. Well, I mean, it's new with time. Yeah. But okay, now we're going to start getting into some of the underwear. Okay, okay. now we're going to get outside the box stuff that Greg picked up last week. I did list it in the vintage category. I had less than a dollar in all of these. Right. And it's not something that I always pick up or what. You normally don't see, like, vintage men's underwear. Right. And there was a whole bunch of them. Um, there was a jock strap. And I'm like, I don't have anything in it. I'm going to try them. So, we some did. of them sold good. Some of them didn't sell great. But I sold every single pair of them. You did. So, 
These were just the old nylon, no brand, eight bucks. Eight bucks. I mean, they're old. They are old. They're like 80s, 70s, 80s. These were just These some, were stretched. They were stretched out, 650. These two were like brand new, or this one, these were like definitely brand new. Um, these sold for $46. $46. They're, the brand is 5050, which when I looked up the RN number, it's Cinderella Knitting Mills, um, which I guess they've made t shirts and stuff. 46 bucks for those. And it so. doesn't weigh very much. That was awesome. Love it. Love it. These are Munsingware me mesh ones. These the are same also person bought these. These two, bought, yeah, thirty-one dollars um, on those. Thirty-one dollars, yeah, all mesh. Mesh like a kangaroo pocket thing. Yep, thirty-one dollars. Some people have kangaroos that they have to have a pocket for. Guess, okay, right? so somebody listed those and had a little toy kangaroo in the pouch. Somebody had them listed on eBay. Oh, is that what you do? No, but I'm just saying they had it a little toy <laughs> it was kind of funny hmm. oh yes the research i had to do for those no i'm just kidding there, there's more it's just kind of mixed in it is kind of mixed in this is a vintage corn. corn um it has a hole it has bleach you know it has some spots it's you know, kind of messed up 1550 and I, I couldn't read the date i didn't know if it was like 2002 or something i could i, I don't think it's a, i think it's older than that isn't it i don't know i thought it was like 99 i don't know or... you took a picture i'm not sure what it said so i didn't put it <laughs> i just put vintage um vintage red shorts they just, these didn't have a brand or anything they're kind of like totally 80s looking to me we picked them up sold them for six bucks six at the bucks. auction we used to do really well with those here's some more of the here's men's uh, munson wear underwear 30 bucks 30 bucks and another pair, exactly the same. Not exactly. It's a different they're color, a different color. But they're the same thing. Thirty bucks. Thirty bucks. The same person got those too. Yeah. Spalding. These were stretched out. Yeah. I'll six bucks. Six bucks. These other ones, the logo was like faded on them or something like that. There wasn't a brand on the stretched. tag. A little stretch. Six bucks. Here's so my these mess next up. ones. She didn't put jockey in the title. And he was like, these are good. I don't understand. And like, we, we looked at it. I mean, we you probably looked at it 50 times this week. But And I never noticed it did not say jockey. And then I realized I didn't put jockey in the title. I put it in the old. description. They are. And they're like, feel really cool. Okay, sorry. They sold for 10 50 though. 10 50 So I made if a big mistake. If she would have put jockey, they probably would have sold for... 30 bucks. But, you know, what can you do? 50 bucks. Who knows? I don't know. I was still pretty happy with my underwear pickup. Yeah. I seriously like you sold quite a bit in one pound worth of underwear over $200 so it's just on that you want to make sure if you listed it, it is under the vintage you got to make sure they are vintage though oh these are vintage no right no, because no they don't allow used underwear sales so and vintage is vintage, a different right. thing yes yeah, so vintage 80s OP shorts six bucks six bucks I feel like we're chatty today and we have lots of stuff Lots of Jansen swim short trunks like vintage thirteen twenty five, and 15. that guy got that. He got this vineyard vines, um, fifteen bucks. Okay, that's something I had out. Buy it now. He offered, and then he also and then the got jock this. strap. When I when I picked up these underwear, they were all in one bin. I also picked up this jock strap, but there was probably at least six or eight other jock straps, but they were stretched. They were gross. I, I didn't I didn't get those. This one looked decent, so I grabbed it, and this sold for forty six bucks. Forty six dollars. I love them. If you go back to some of our older videos, like really old when we like first started doing videos, he used to find quite a few jock straps in find California, and I mean we sold some for hundreds of dollars for the vintage ones. A lot vintage. of people in California like to wear vintage jock straps. I well, guess. we used to do really well. So he was excited to pick that up, sold for 46 bucks. So that's yeah. awesome. Jock so now, straps, exciting, I guess. Okay, Shirley got five items here. Shirley did? Shirley did. She got okay. these super cute fox. Um, these are cute. That's why Lula I picked them up. Plus they're like brand new. I think they are. And then she got two more LuLaRoe items. This too is. have to open them all up. This too is like brand new. It is new. I mean, it still even has the tags on it. Okay, so there's that, so and then she got, she got this other Lularoe that was this new. This is like brand new too. Like brand new. Has the tags. 
And she got, what is this? Gap? Gap. This is Lux. like brand new too. It's new with tags. Yeah. Super cute. Okay. And then she got What's this she got J. Jill. Yes. So she got all those things. This is old and destroyed. No, it's not. It's no, super cute. It's it not looks new really with tag. Nice. It's like, not new with tag though. It's nice, but it's like crinkly. I love it. Okay. She got, so she those, got things. those things. $38 shipped on those. So that price is shipped. Okay. Thank you for that. I know. Shirley, thank you so much. So this... Yes, Brittany got these. Shop Foxborough if you follow her on Instagram or she has YouTube also. I picked this she, up. I obviously was hoping Michelle would wear it. Too bad. But. <laughs> she gets the most amazing vintage stuff. She does? I mean, she also gets modern stuff, but always so Look cute. this little hat. You know how She's cute funny. you would have been in this? Well, she, Brittany's going to wear it now. So thank you, Brittany, for buying this so I don't have to wear it. It's super cute. Yeah. It's like a pinafore. She said uh -huh. she's going to do something pirate like pirate uh -huh. related with that so okay. that'll be interesting to see and she also got this bally bodysuit she got that and this yeah this like vintage bally all lace bodysuit super cute 25 dollars shipped on those things okay but if you do see those bally like some of them are pretty good so if you see those vintage bally even the bras like the all lace ones you know it has to be the vintage bally tag well, i know so, what they are you know what they are yeah Brittany, thank you so much. Don't forget to check out her YouTube channel. I know we got a few other people that have YouTube channels that bought stuff. This we got Annie, we got Brittany. So what did you tell her YouTube channel? I did. What? What was it? And she was she she was back over. I mean, where's my page? My page with all my stuff. Just call oh. me Annie. Hello. I knew that. <laughs> and then Brittany is shop Foxborough. Oh, that's her. That's that's, that's her YouTube. The event. Yeah. So they have the, both those YouTube channels. Okay. Oh, so these sorry. curtains, we picked up four of these. Yes. Um, they're Pottery Barn silk. Yes. And then when we went back that night on my birthday, because we went you twice on my birthday, one. I got the big one. We didn't sell the big one yet. We didn't sell the big one yet. But I sold the but four. But we sold the four of these. And I actually sold them on Wednesday, but she asked, can I wait a few days to pay? And I'm like, totally. Sounds good. So yeah. we so didn't we sell these on Wednesday. I'm be, yeah. So I'm like, hey, we can have them on Soul Sunday. So that's awesome. $199 for those four curtains. $199. So yeah, keep an eye out for those Pottery Barn silk. Curtains and underwear. Curtains and underwear. But okay. as you can see, we sold a lot of other stuff too. Not just curtains. It's and true. We did. And we're almost done showing you what we sold. And we do these sold videos so you can see, hey, maybe you could pick up some stuff like this and, you know, where you're at and sell it. Just to kind of show this is... You know, we show what we get in a haul, but then it's like, oh, here's what we sold. I mean, which this is actually pretty good because we just showed a lot of this stuff. If you watch our last two hauls, we yeah, made two hauls. A lot of this stuff was in there. Like this day. was in there, right? North Face, Reversible, Moss Bud, um, Jacket. Heather got this. Thank you so much, Heather. $32. These super cute Crocs. 18 bucks. And every time I sell Crocs, I think of the Thirsty Thrifters. And I think. Tara. I can't believe she sold these, but. <laughs> 18 bucks, right? Well, see, Tara says she sells them too. She yeah, picks them she up. She said that. She did say that. I know. They went to the bed. Dave spent all day at the shoes. He all got, day? No, well, the whole time they were there. Oh. He got some good shoes too. Yeah. And she got some good stuff. So they must have went the day after we did and the good stuff was still going through the I think he got bed. some Uggs with holes in them too. You ever do that? We used to pick those <laughs> up and sell them. We could sell them. Back in the day. I know I miss their live. So the Thirsty Thrifters, <coughs> you know, they they did a live video. I always miss her live, so then I have to watch it the next day. But this is new. They crack me up. <coughs> this is yeah, new. This is brand new. Uh, Renu. I don't know what it is. West Point is what it is. West Point. It's like a poncho, new a tag thingy. It Thir is a poncho. Thirty bucks. Thirty bucks. Two more things. Two more things. Two this more Anna Sui Sui. I'm not sure how to say it for Target. So it's right. like a designer collaboration. $22 for this dress. We've had it a long time, but I'll take 22 bucks. It's super cute. That is cute. For sure. Very, very cute. And then new a tag, William Sonoma. 20 bucks. Oven mitt. 20 bucks. Sometimes Definitely. it's not the clothes. It's the best. I mean, an oven mitt for 20 bucks isn't too bad. I is know, it? right? It's so I'll light too. It. I mean, I, I love it. I love it too. Now he wants to okay. go back to the bed. I want to hear what we sold because we sold a lot of stuff, as you could see. So we spent we $75.46. Spent... Wow, we... $75 is our cost on this. Yeah, well, we had the thing from Thread Up. All right. So, and then there's plus all the stuff from the bin. 
Okay. So we sold everything for one thousand eight hundred and eighty-three dollars and eighty-seven cents. One thousand eight. We haven't had that good of weekend in a really, really, really long time. So thankful. But like, there was a lot on Macari and Poshmark. There too. was. Because eBay is just, you're like, oh yay, and then it's like, oh yeah, and then it's like, yeah, oh yeah. You know what I mean? eBay is just so not consistent. So on those days, it seems like Poshmark will come through with a few sales, or Macari will. Yeah, so it definitely helps. So our on. profit. So after fees, it, this is average, right? After fees and cost oh, I can't of believe goods. we were that close to two thousand dollars over the weekend in sales, not including shipping. I know. Good job, babe. We worked hard this week. We did work hard. And we are very thankful that people came in and decided to buy our stuff. Yes. So our profit was $1,563.50 or, you know, about that. That's an, that's about what it that's was. Enough. But so that's about after fees and cost of goods. Cost of goods. You know, you still got to pay taxes. You still got to pay that kind of stuff. But right. with the fees out of it and the cost of goods. Yeah. So $1,500 profit. That's, that's over two days. Really I'll good take for it. us. Take our it. gross return on investment was 2,396% and our net return on investment is 1,971%. So 19 times our money after fees and cost of goods. Thank you, curtains and underwear. Underwear, yeah. And everything else we and sold. And everything in between. Yeah, we. it was fun. It was so fun. Like, the bin. To be, the bin was fun. Working really Selling hard Selling all this the stuff week. was fun. It was like the old days, though. Like... I would go do my stuff at the post office, come back, and I started listing, and I was listing, like, all day. You know? I mean, Rose made food, like, all this week. So, she would make food, and they'd be like, dinner's ready, and then I'd go out and eat and well, go Well, I made some stuff on the grill. and No, yeah, that's true. Stuff like that, too. But three days this week, Rose made dinner for us, yeah. which I was really... Th I mean, I know you helped her, but you know what I mean. Right. She, she was really sweet to do that, so... We all work together here. We're like a family team. Everybody pitches in. She's going to be 17 I know, here. next week. Yeah. And Crazy. I'm only going to be 27. How's that work? Just kidding. I'm going to be 44. 44? Yes. Well, you're still young. Yeah. Okay, we'll go. We're like chatty and this video is really long. We're so thankful. Sorry for the video is so sales. long, but glad thank that we you. sold all this stuff. So. I know. And thank you everybody yeah. that bought anything. Yes, thank you. Thank you, the van. We feel really blessed that um, we get to do what we like to do and be home with our kids what and love all this stuff. And being home. Love yeah. that, too. I know. So, anyway. We'll wouldn't let you go. change it. Hope you guys had a great weekend. I would change some things, but. Okay, well, we won't talk about that now. Yeah. Okay, not, we'll be back be this week. Video. I'm sure he's going to drag me to the bin. Oh, I'm going. I'm going. Okay. Pick outside the box. Sometimes you got to get something different, like, you know, oven mitt. 20 bucks. Yeah. You do what you got to do, vintage right? Vintage men's underwear. 46 bucks. Jock strap. 46 bucks. What can you do? Love it. We well, got to do what you got to do. It makes it a lot more fun. Okay, did you pick, pick outside, outside of the, box? the box? Thanks for watching. Thanks for every to everyone for watching, buying, whatever you did. Uh, we'll see you with a haul this week. Okay, thank you. Thank you, guys. God bless you. Bye.